guys, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on WW Personal Points. Happy Saturday, it's Saturday so it's grocery haul day. I have a huge haul for you. I just did my massive haul, now I have another huge slash massive haul for you because it was monthly stock up at Costco. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not because I upload a grocery haul every Saturday and five videos a week. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching where I offer personalized to you macros and calories. Highly, highly, highly recommend and one-on-one -on -one coaching if you would like to chat with me directly. Links and discounts to my favorite things and come join my Facebook group. We'd love to have you. So let's jump into another huge grocery haul. So here's this week's grocery haul. I made a quick stop at Sprouts. Walmart and then did my monthly Costco stock up. I always know when it's time to go to Costco because Diesel's medicine needs refilled. So I made my run to Costco. Just a couple of things from Sprouts. You guys know I love the baby Persian cucumbers. They're my all time favorite. I also needed some dry roasted peanuts for a recipe. I have a really fun recipe video coming your guys' way on Sunday. So stay tuned for that. So I needed some dry roasted peanuts and I thought it would make most sense to just get them in bulk since I didn't need a lot. And then I grabbed a couple of Granny Smith apples as well. And then moving on to Walmart, I needed some mini marshmallows. This is for my Sunday video. I'm telling you guys, you're not gonna wanna miss it. And then I also needed some candy corn for that video. We're going to my neighbor's on Friday night for a little taco bar get together. So I'll just bring the leftovers there. Vanilla wafers and cinnamon graham crackers also for Sunday's video. And then I decided to pick up these. These are, these are really cute. This is a, this is a plastic plate, orange and black and then a purple bowl. I'm going to put the goodies on here to take over to my neighbors. These are 50 cents a piece at Walmart. You can't beat it. And then I finally found the pumpkin pie light and fit yogurt. So excited, so I picked up two of those. And then I also grabbed one of the caramel apple because I like that flavor as well. I have not seen the pumpkin pie chobani, the zero sugar. That's the one I really wanted to try, but light and fit will do. I grabbed a couple more of these little snack packs for Troy. He really likes to take these golfing. It just makes it easy for him to have a snack. I needed some sugar-free vanilla jello pudding for Sunday's recipe and they were out of the small box so I just picked up the big box and lots of whipped topping for that recipe. So I have two of the light whipped topping again for Sunday. Also for Sunday's recipe I needed some mandarin oranges as well as some pineapple tidbits and then I decided to pick up the no sugar added apple pie filling because I want to make a apple pie oatmeal bowl or apple pie yogurt bowl. Remember I made the Black Forest one. It was so good. And now I am here for the fall apple pie bowl. So stay tuned for that recipe in this week's What I Eat in a Day. And lastly, I needed some yellow mustard. And then moving on over to Costco, a two pack of fat free milk for Troy. Some more mouthwash because we are almost completely out and the Listerine is my favorite. I also needed some more glass measuring cups. I had a plastic one and it got pretty dingy, grimy, gr grody, so I threw it away. You get all three of these for $13.99, which I thought was a really good deal. They're the Pyrex brand. They're glass, so they'll last forever. I picked up another box of the peanut butter, banana licious, doggy, delirious treats. These are currently on sale at Costco for a really good price and my dogs actually really like these. This is literally one of my very favorite seasonings. I am almost out. That's how much I use this. I love this in my copycat KFC bowl with the chicken and the potatoes and the veggies and gravy. So good. So I went ahead and picked up a refill. Making a Halloween charcuterie board for Halloween. My in-laws are coming over on the 30th for a Halloween dinner. So I grabbed this meat tray. I thought this will make my life so easy. So there's to Toscano dry salami, uncured pepperoni, sopracetta, and nostrano dried salami. And then I picked up the cheese variety pack as well, already pre-cut. Again, aged cheddar, Jarlsberg Swiss, creamy Havarti, and Dutch Gouda. So I thought, again, super simple. If you want to do a Halloween or Thanksgiving charcuterie board, really affordable prices as well. Of course, some toilet paper and some paper towels, which are 
always on the list at Costco. I grabbed another bag of the eight in one dog benef multi benefit shoes. Here's all the things these shoes do. My vet actually highly recommends these. My dogs get these every single morning, all three of them. I'm so happy Costco is still carrying them because I heard that they may not be. So I'm really happy that they still have them. So I picked up another bag. And then I decided that I want to start incorporating a little bit more walnuts into my diet. They're really good for your heart and they keep you nice and full. And this was $7.99 for this huge bag. I'm going to start putting this in my yogurt bowls, in my oatmeal. I'm really, I really just want to incorporate a little bit more healthy nuts and I thought walnuts would be a great place to start. And then I picked up another four pack of the Thomas English muffins for Troy. He is still on breakfast sandwich kick. So we like to throw these in the freezer until he's ready to open a pack. And then they had some amazing deals on clothing. This spider pullover jacket, I got it for Troy in an extra, extra large. This is on sale for $29.99. You guys, that is an incredible, incredible deal. This is probably a 60 or $70 jacket. So grab it while it's still at Costco and it is on coupon right now for $29.99. And then I got this super cute flannel. It is seriously so soft for myself. This was $10.99. I picked it up in a size medium. It is seriously so soft and I love the colors. And then I grabbed some pajamas. This entire set of Lucky Brand pajamas, $9. There is a t-shirt, shorts, and a tank top. And again, I picked mine up in a size medium. That is everything for this week's grocery haul from Costco, Walmart, and Sprouts. Let's jump into what's for dinner and what you'll be seeing in Monday's meal prep. So here is what is on my menu for the week. So today, Saturday, is an out for dinner day. Tomorrow, I am making a Sloppy Joe's. Monday, I'll be doing a chicken pot pie with biscuits. You guys will actually see this recipe in next Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. Tuesday's a leftover night, Wednesday's tacos. Thursday, I'm doing a quick, easy sheet pan dinner. And then Friday, we'll eat up all the leftovers from earlier in the week. And since I didn't have meal prep last Monday, here is what you'll see in this week's meal prep. It is back and I'm excited. So for breakfast, I'm making ham and cheese scones. I love a good savory scone. Lunch is going to be honey garlic chicken. This is a crock pot recipe, super, super simple. And then for dessert, I get to make my maple oatmeal apple pie. I've been craving apple pie, so I am so excited. So stay tuned on Monday for all three recipes. Thank you for joining me for this week's WW Grocery Haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing another big haul from me from Sprouts, Walmart, and Costco. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and your bell's turned on. You don't want to miss tomorrow's video with those yummy recipes. And of course, check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things. And don't forget, come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. Happy Saturday, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.